Hey everyone, Weatherbug meteorologist Miranda Hilger is back with your National Outlook. We are still talking about Anna, who is currently impacting places like Hawaii with some gusty wind, a little bit of heavy rainfall, and strong waves. Now, Anna is a hurricane category one status and will likely remain so as we move forward in time. But it'll weaken briefly as it moves away from the Hawaiian Islands. But we do see a re-strengthening in the forecast by Thursday and Friday. The good news is here, no land really at risk. It's just mainly a few shipping lanes and some slow moving whales, as we like to say in the weather studio. A little closer to home in the lower 48, we've been watching for some wet weather in the desert southwest, the Pacific Northwest, another few waves of energy coming on shore here. And a low pressure system continues to move through the Great Lakes and Northeast, bringing them some gray drizzly weather through the next couple of days. But uh, certainly we will be watching for a, a big jet stream pattern shift here coming into the next few days. A ridge is building in here across the central U.S., which brings warmer weather into the high plains and the Great Lakes. Meanwhile, this trough digging on shore or digging in here is really going to provide us with some unsettled weather in the northeast, the clouds, the showers, et cetera, when we have the rainfall. And this trough coming on shore here in the Pacific Northwest, that will give us some very heavy rainfall as well. Temperatures have tumbled where we had this first uh, wave of cold air moving through in the past 24 hours. We've seen the Great Lakes, the northeast, and even into the southeast cooling down considerably to below average conditions. And that'll be the theme going forward today for your forecast high as high pressure is overhead. And that means the cool, clear air will be all across the eastern seaboard. This low pressure system moves through and gives us some of that unsettled wet weather. And we're still tracking some rainfall for the southern Rockies. Now in the Pacific Northwest, we've got that rain ongoing, especially across the Oregon coast, and totals will be climbing day by day. So expect at least a few inches of precipitation out that direction as we have the remnants of Vong Fong impacting the region. Here's your forecast across the nation throughout the afternoon.